we dream of a Christianity that looks like Jesus again. We, we, we read the, the words of the gospel and, and Jesus' you know, the things that he said in those red letters. And, and we say, what if he really meant this stuff? What if we were to live our lives based on, on the, the words of Jesus? Uh, how do you believe in capital punishment when Jesus says, blessed are the merciful, for they shall obtain mercy? And if you're going to say, but if somebody commits a murder, shouldn't he have to pay with his life? To which Jesus would say what? It's no longer an eye for an eye and a tooth for a tooth. I say overcome evil with good. Uh, it's revolutionary and radical stuff. It's really asking the question that the little pin asked a long time ago. WWJD, what would Jesus do? Well, we deal with uh, the environment. We deal with immigration. immigration. Middle East. Middle East, we deal heavily. Sexuality. Both of us have been very involved in Middle East stuff. Sexuality, we deal with human sexuality. And not just the gay issue, but the whole question of does the church really understand uh, homosexuality? Uh, and does it understand heterosexuality? Does it understand sex, period? And we're asking those kinds of questions. And I think we bring to the reader uh, a, a kind of commitment to Jesus on the one hand and a sense of, of uh, informed perceptions of what's going on in the world on the other. And as he said so well, try to get the Bible to speak to these issues that are troubling us.